At sea level, the human body contains around one liter of nitrogen evenly dissolved throughout the body. During an underwater dive, as the nitrogen pressure inside the lungs increases, more nitrogen will spread throughout the body. The amount of dissolved nitrogen in the body increases with the dive's depth and duration. For instance, at a pressure of about 4 atmospheres, 30 meters deep, the body will dissolve around 4 liters of nitrogen. To prevent nitrogen narcosis, divers must partially or completely replace nitrogen with another inert gas like helium. Helium is the replacement gas of choice for four reasons. Helium has only a fraction of the narcotizing effect of nitrogen. Helium dissolves in the tissues to a lesser extent than nitrogen. Helium has a lower density than, than nitrogen and this lowers the airway resistance. And during the decompression phase of a dive, helium diffuses out of the tissues more rapidly than nitrogen does. To prevent to prevent oxygen toxicity, divers must reduce the fraction of air that is oxygen in the compressed gas mixture. As I mentioned in previous videos, at sea level, oxygen makes up around 20% of the air pressure of one atmosphere. At a pressure 10 times higher of 10 atmospheres, 90 meters deep, the compressed gas mixture needs only 2% oxygen to provide the same oxygen pressure as 20% at sea level.